quick tools. Here's an interesting setup that I used in an ongoing project of mine. I needed to create a scissors mechanism like this, and it had to be rigged in such a way that I only need to animate one object and the rest should follow automatically. In this video, I'm going to show you how to recreate the same rig by using constraints. First of all, let me show you the model of the scissors rod. Make sure that the model's pivot point is located at the joint part here, so that it rotates correctly when we rig it. Also note that the rod is moved off-center from the pivot point, so that it fits nicely when we duplicate and flip it to the other side. I also have a cylindrical model here that will be used to lock the rods in the middle. The two rectangular objects here will act as the top and bottom platforms for our scissors mechanism. Let's start rigging by parenting each of the rods to their corresponding platforms, left to the bottom and right to the top. Then parent the platforms to the corresponding empties which will be used to drive the whole rig. Next, add a track 2 constraint to both of the rods and make them point at each other. If we move the top empty now, you will see that they are working as intended. Select both of the rods and duplicate them to make up the other side of the scissors. All we have to do now is to make the cylindrical model here to always stay locked in the middle of the scissors. To do that, we need to give it a copy location constraint and pick the bottom platform as the target. Then, give it another copy location constraint and pick the top platform as the target, but this time, set the influence to only 0.5. The rig is basically done now, but see what happens if you move the platforms too far apart. To fix this, we can give the top empty a limit location constraint and set its minimum and maximum Z values in local space. To top it off, you can lock the location of the X and Y axis to avoid moving the platform sideways accidentally. Thank you for watching, save your file, and I'll see you in the next video. Hi! <laughs> Subscribe!